The story begins with Andrei Kakushian, a Ukrainian-born U.S. citizen arrested in San Francisco last week. No comments. His parents had no comment, but helped free him from jail by securing their home as part of a $1 million bond. Kakushian has been linked to retail marijuana dispensaries in Sacramento. How you Along with another man, Garib Karapetian, who is believed to own several pot shops in Sacramento, even though the city has strict rules on multiple ownerships. Karapetian has reportedly donated approximately $3,000 to Sacramento Mayor Daryl Steinberg, and there were also reported donations to Sacramento City Councilman Jay Chenier, and that's troubling to government watchdog Craig Powell. We believe it's, it's an inherent conflict of interest for any city office holder or any candidate for city office to be taking any money from any holder of a city license or permit. Mayor Daryl Steinberg declined an on-camera interview today, but in a statement he told KCRA 3, if this story is true, then our cannabis licensing process, which was designed to protect consumers and reward local law-abiding businesses, is being improperly exploited. Steinberg's office said the mayor is immediately returning the 2016 political contributions by donating them to Sacramento Boys and Girls Club. Steinberg is calling for an immediate investigation into the licensing process, a process that has been without a formal leader since Joe Devlin vacated his post as Sacramento's pot czar very abruptly last May. Councilman Jay Chenier was in New York today, but told me by phone he supports the investigation and says he's also given the donations to nonprofits. But Craig Powell is demanding more. Well, what we're, we're asking for is for the FBI uh, to come in and do a thorough investigation uh, of the circumstances under which uh, this campaign cash was donated, whether rules were broken.